so I went to Hers Tita and also Giant. Giant has a new section in there where it's specialty sessions. So you have like Italian, you have keto, paleo, um, different like um, anithesis and stuff like that. So they are getting hip that a lot of people do keto. So they had a whole keto section and I'm just gonna share with you guys some of the items that I got um, from Giant. Majority of, actually everything is from Giant. I'm gonna start off with the one item I did get from Hearst Teeter this time around, which is avocado. Actually it's a avocado blend, which is avocado and extra virgin olive oil. That's all they had, all the avocado was sold out. So. This one say blend, but I like this for keto because you can get the extra version olive oil, olive oil and avocado. And then they have versions where you get um, coconut oil. Um, and all of them are blended with avocado. But I got this from Hearst Teeter. And you can get it at you know a whole bunch of different places. The next thing um, I want to show you guys is something I'm excited about. I'm so prayerful that it tastes delicious because I absolutely loved Cinnamon Toast Crunch, okay? And um, they had a Cinnamon Toast Crunch version for keto. Um, and I was just like, oh, let's try, let's give it a try, okay? So I'm excited about this. It has zero sugars, 11 grams of protein, nine fiber, and let me see, um, let me see. And then it only has five, um, five carbs. Yeah, five carbs. So I'm gonna be trying this cereal out. You can use it as a snack as well. Also, I love pancakes. So they had this pancake mix. Um, and my sister said, just add a little vanilla and a little bit of cinnamon to it if you want to. Um, and some people might need to add a little bit of sugar. It depends on how you like your pancakes. Um, but yeah, this is keto, um, mix for your, your, um, pancakes. The next thing I'm about, I'm excited about is we, she picked up some because we were having soup, um, and we typically put noodles in our soup, but being keto, you have to find, you know, the zero carb um, or calorie noodles and, you know, they call them miracle noodles and things like that. But when she went in the store, she found some other ones and she found this brand. And this brand makes spaghetti, panini, and I also got the fettuccine. So I only got the, the spaghetti and the fatty chains. The spaghetti ones is really, really good. Um, so I got that so that I can make, um, I got stuff to make three different meals to be honest, cause I get bored. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna make me a keto spaghetti. I'm gonna make me a keto chicken fettuccine or shrimp fettuccine with the fettuccine noodles. And this is carb balance um, tortillas. This is what we use to make our quesadillas or like a sandwich wrap, um, like you would get from Tropical Smoothie and whatnot. Um, so, so excited. I finally got this bread because it has four carbs five proteins and it's only 70 calories. And it's three grams of fat. So got all that. And so far out of all of the keto yogurt, the only one, the brand that I like is this one called Ratio um, Keto. And my two favorite flavors from them is the uh, mango and the strawberry. Those are the two that I really enjoy. Next up, I got cheese, which I do have some carbs in it, but it's okay. And I love Smithfield bacon. I just feel like it's not no rinky dink cheap bacon. So I picked me up some, some bacon. I got the thick cut and then I got the thick cut cherry wood to try that one out. 
I've always got um, the apple wood one, but I got the cherry wood this time. Um, and that's just for breakfast or whenever I break my fast. Also, I got some chicken breasts because like I said, I'm gonna make some chicken and shrimp fettuccine probably tomorrow because that's gonna take too long to do today. And I also have um, sweet Italian sausage and ugh, I'm not to clean this. And I have some ground beef um, for my spaghetti. So I got all my stuff to make um, the things that I wanna make. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to clean these off. So I'm gonna sit those over there. Make myself some counter space. So I can show you guys the snacks. Um, they had a lot of different snacks. Some of them I have tried before because my sister does the keto crate every month. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna dump this bag out and just show you what I picked up to try. And as I try them, I'm gonna post them and let you know what I think about them. So the first thing I have is called Monk Pack. It's keto granola bars. The, the flavor I got was the maple pecan. Um, it's just like a chewy, but um, it's eight grams of carbs, 13 grams of fat, only 140 calories. Um, so that's a good for a snack. Your snack should never be over 150 calories. Um, also, I got some individual monk packs. These ones are like full of seeds and different things like that and have like dark chocolate on it. Um, so I, I have the pumpkin seed cinnamon almond, sea salt dark chocolate, and my sister must have took my other one because I have two of the same one, but it's okay. Um, the next thing I got because I absolutely love, um, uh, what are they called? Peanut butter cups, Reese cups. I got some keto cups. <laughs> this particular one is hazelnut butter and it's two net carbs, 10 grams of fat. Um, and that's per one cup. You get 10 grams of fat per one cup and it's two grams. It's 130 calories. So that's a nice little snack to treat yourself. Also, I picked this up only because I was 100% interested in it because the texture through the bag felt like rice cakes. So I picked this up once again. This one is, um, the serving size is the whole bag. It's 130 calories and it only has six net carbs and 10 grams of fat. Okay, so if you're like me and you love cluster foods like granola, um, different balls that's granola style, then you're definitely gonna love these next two items that I got. This one's called clusters. So the clusters is um, 170 grams of carbs, I mean, mm, 170 calories, and it has seven, let me see, four grams of protein, 14 grams of fat, and I think it's seven net carbs, it's either seven or two. Um, I don't see on the bag where it says it because I'm not sure what type of sugar it is to know if I can subtract that or not, but it's either seven or two net carbs and it looks like this. Last but not least, this one is multi-grain free. It's a grain free. This is the original one. Once again, this is like a granola mix. Um... And this one is 107 calories as well. And 
The total carbohydrates is, I mean the, yeah, yeah, yeah. The total net carbs is, I want to say five, but if the sugars that's in it, um, is added, then it's like one or two. So this is going to be really, really good. And it has 15 grams, grams of fat and four grams of protein. So, yeah, that's what I got, you know, from the grocery store for um, my keto. You know, you got to find ways to make it work. And that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do my due diligence and, you know, and do what I got to do to make it work. So, hope you guys go out and try these items and tell me what you think of them, okay? Bye.